not take more, like much more. Yusuf السلام, he lived in what? When he was in the prison, he was brought out. It was a non-Muslim government. It was a corrupt government. Most likely it was a pharaoh at his time. Yusuf السلام, didn't say, I'm safe from the prison. Let me go and hide in my house. What did he do? He asked for one of the most senior public posts, right? He asked for it. What do we do as a Muslim community when Muslims get active? And by the way, they will inevitably make mistakes. Political world is very difficult, it's very charged, it's very competitive, it's very cynical. So active Muslims are gonna make mistakes. What do we do? We are the first ones to shoot them down. Why? Because we said in the comfort of our homes, he did that mistake. That was wrong. That was incorrect. That was inappropriate, right? That's, you, that's what you call cowardice. If you're unable to do anything, hold off. Don't speak. Let people who know speak. People are going to make mistakes. People are going to fall into sometimes big mistakes. We can have a discussion. We can have a dialogue and we can help them out. And so on and so forth. People are going to make big mistakes. Ibn Taymiyyah talks about Yusuf and he says he had this post, he held this post in a non-Muslim government that was corrupt and had a corrupt system. And he must have complied with some of those, some of those rules. But he figured out the benefit would be greater than the harm. That's what Ibn Taymiyyah says about the story of Yusuf But we are Puritans, we are perfectionists now when Muslims become activists, right? We pick on the nitty gritty details and we forget that we need to support the, those people. We need to give them advice when they make mistakes as well. But we, we shouldn't be assassinating them politically and gunning them down and withholding our support. So we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala at the end to accept our brothers and sisters. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect the Muslims everywhere. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala open our, our eyes to the truth of this religion and open the, the eyes of the world to the truth about Islam. And we, and we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to strengthen us, to act on what the moments demand of us. Allahumma ghafir al-mu'minina wal-mu'minat wal-muslimina wal-muslimat al-ahya'i minhum wal-amwat. Allahumma ghafir lana dhunubana wa israfana fi amrina. Wa thabbit aqdamana wa ansurna ala al-qawm al-kafirin. Allahumma arham jami'a mawta al-muslimin al-lazina shahidu laka bil-wahdaniyya. Wa li nabiyyika bil-risalati wa matu ala thalik. Allahumma arhamna idha sirna ila ma saru ilayh. Subhana rabbika rabbil izzati amma yasifun. Wa salamun ala al-mursaleen. الحمد لله رب العالمين